Hey, this is Don McDowell with the Pragmatic View of the Obvious. You know, we spent a lot of time uh, preparing for the radio show on hunting and fishing. Anymore, it's a joke. We're broadcasting from the Biden Banana Republic, and the distractions that the Dems are throwing out there, uh, especially around uh, gun control, there was some stuff tied up in and around the uh, same time that the uh, the COVID relief package, $1.9 trillion was being passed. Uh, there's some uh, Second Amendment stuff that you, you need to know about and be very, very clear that these are clear and present dangers to uh, our Second Amendment. The first one's H.R. 8, uh, which is a use, universal background check for all firearms uh, transactions. That, that's private. That's public. Uh, whatever. Uh, basically, uh, that means that I'm a criminal if I want to give a firearm to my grandson. Okay? I mean, that's, that, that's the long and the short of it. Uh, the second bill uh, I want to bring your attention was H.R. 1446. This has to do with background checks. And uh, basically what it does, you know, we have a three-day background uh, ATF check uh, right now, uh, the FBI and ATF is involved in it. Uh, the FFL calls it in, and they have three days to respond. If they don't respond in those three days, the FFL completes the transaction. But they want it to go to 10 days. Uh, wow, that, that's pretty scary. You know, th this whole thing is headed for what we've seen in Europe prior to World War II. I'm not going to use the, the term Nazi, but if it walks like a duck and smells like a duck, uh, might be a Democrat uh, acting like uh, what we saw for gun registration. You know, and they're, and they're saying HR8 is not gun registration. I'm calling Bernie Sanders on it only because I can't say bullshit on the air. So I'm going to use the term Bernie Sanders to make my point across. That's exactly what it is. Call your senators. We've got to stop this. Call your representatives in the House. There were seven of them. I, I got to tell you this. I, 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 can't, I can't get over this. Seven Republicans, one from Illinois, two from Florida, one from Michigan, one from New Jersey, and, of course, one from New York. What in the hell is the matter with these people? They need to be ousted out of office.